Hello everybody with confetti from Dr. McHarney and Devil Lord X13 everywhere. We bring you Doc, what do we bring you? TF2's friggin' birthday! Doc, tell him about the little surprise we have in store for him today. Party, 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 Confetti! Aside from the confetti and us taunting like stupid oh. idiots. Ooh, isn't today a double episode? Today is a double episode, Dr. McCarnia. Who are we bringing I, out today? Ooh, um, um, Soldier and, um... Go self-destruct, please, Doc. But I have Uber charge. You've been spared. God damn it! <laughs> oh, no. We bring you the medic and the sniper today. Doc, will you cover the medic first, my Mulfrey? Oh, hell no. That's just ignorant. Please cover the medic first. I guess I can cover the medic, since I'm going to be doing the base loadout first. I had to. <laughs> This annoying sound in the game now. I love it. <laughs> this game just got a whole lot more annoying. Ah, uh, the, the syringe gun. Fugliest piece of shit ever. Oh, why is it the fugliest piece of shit ever? No, seriously, have you looked at it like that? As you're holding it, have you seen how he holds it? It is uglier than shit. Why, uh, do you think I prefer the Crusader's crossbow? True. But, Syringe gun has a 40 round clip with a 150 max ammo. Not bad. It's got a nice rate of fire and all, all that good shit. I cannot hit that engine. <laughs> I couldn't. I couldn't hit that engine to save my life. Why do you think I don't use the syringe gun? Wow. Unless I start critting. What kind of damage do you deal, Doc? Well, if I'm not critting, 10s and 11s and 12s. If I am critting, dead. How so? 30s. Lots oh. and lots of 30s. Oh no! See? Look at this crap. It takes just... Yeah, it has a 40 round clip and all, which is nice. If it didn't take, you know, the entire 40 round clip to bring somebody down. Taste and God, God help you. Now, even if you're fighting a... Like, if you're fighting a heavy, God help you. Like, the rate of fire is impressive, and the only thing I don't care for is the arc. How is like, the I'm, arc? Like, I'm aiming directly at that NG right now. Look at those needles. They're just falling a tad short, but as soon as I aim over him... Damn! You can take down multiple people with those crits, can't you? Well, you know, that's also with the server constantly refilling my ammo supply, too. That's not counting the, you know, the couple second reload that he has. Yeah. And then, you know, I've got the medic gun. Or the medi gun. Ooh. Mm. Basically, well, mine's strange, but basically it heals people. You know, woo, nice and all. I can, as you can see off Dev's little health bar, his health bar has gone over what it was before, which I think it's at what, 200 now? 225. 225? Okay. Whatever. But the Medigun also has a not nifty little feature, which I don't have Uber charged right now, which I'm building up. Uh, at 100% Uber charge with the base Medigun, I can make somebody invincible for, what would you say, about 10, 15 seconds? Give or take. Now you know. Now you know. We gotta wait for Doc to get his charge up while he's being a lazy ass and commit suicide earlier. Well, I could switch over to my uh, my Uber saw loadout and just get it instantly. No, no, we gotta go one at a time, much like it has always been for us. I know. I hate the rules we make on ourselves. Yes, I'm having a spaz attack right now. I noticed. Come on, Doc, is it done yet? Do Not. it. <laughs> and no, I do not have to have a target when I do this. 
I could literally be that medic and like build up my Uber charge off somebody and then let go of them and Uber charge myself and run away. I've done it before. You bastard! Yep. It is the douchiest thing you can do as a medic is run away with your own Uber charge. Now, what about your bone saw? Ah, uh, the bone saw. Fucking hate it. Thing can't crit for shit. See? Can't crit for shit. Can't. Crit. For shit. <laughs> what do you call those? Ever. Um, nothing. <laughs> Nothing's happening. You can't see nothing. See? Nothing. No crits at all out of all those hits. I fucking hate this weapon. I do, though. I hate all the base loadout weapons, except the medigun. Just for the invulnerability factor. What about the minigun? The minigun? The er, minigun. The mini- oh, the syringe gun? Sasha. Fuck that. What about the shotgun? Fuck the shotgun. But you always hate it when I- well, you always love it when I bust it out, though. You know what I have to say about that? What? What well. do you see? Well, Doc, I'm going to figure out how to censor this, but... Censoring! See, it's a mountain, people. Fucking get your head down the fucking gutter. <laughs> ah. Anyway, what kind of damage do you do with your bone saw? Well, same as every other fucking melee weapon. 65, 65, 65, 65, 65, 195, 195. <laughs> 3 million, 3 million, Fuck. billion, what? Alright, 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 you, you made our point, Doc, you made our point. Well, Doc I'll basically, mm -hmm. Doc basically just told me to uh, switch over to do the... Uh, do it. Medic. So do, it. do it. Do it. Do it. Okay, I'm using the overdose set, which contains the overdose, the quick fix, and the Solomon Val. I do no harm. I never do harm. Nine. Yeah, I know. The overdose is basically like every other mini gun, syringe gun. It's got an arc. Got to control that freaking arc in order to hit shit. There you go. I've seen people with no art control hit it every time. Yeah. I've also got a 10% less damage ability. So I do less. I do 10% less damage than Doc's syringe gun. However, with my Uber charge at 100%, 10% of my Uber charge becomes my own movement speed. Oh, that's you. Yeah. So, with my overdose pulled out, I move faster. 10% faster to be exact, everyone. Now, the quick fix here. The quick fix has a nifty little effect. I have still not left Uber charge. <laughs> okay, you can stop now, Doc. The... <sighs> you weren't supposed to show him this. I don't know what it's doing. Does it even show on that thing? Yes, it does. Oh, wow. I didn't think I didn't think you could do that to a regular medi gun or a quick fix. The quick the quick fix here okay. heals faster than the other medi guns. However, the nifty little feature about it is it only does fifty percent overdose, which is overhealing. Doc, what's your health at? Uh, one eighty nine. Whereas mine is at two twenty five. But however, the cool part about the quick fix here, <laughs> the cool thing about the quick fix here. My healing has been, what, tripled? 300%. Yep, tripled. I heal at a triple fast rate, and I get my uber charge a lot faster than most pe than the other metagun's uber charge. Yeah. And then, you've got the Solomon Vow, which, as the name states, you do no harm. Bullshit. I crit Bullshit. a lot. Bullshit. I crit. See? Crit. I don't know what you're talking about. Those don't look like crits to me. Huh, that wasn't a crit. There's the crit. There's the crit. There's the crit. If you would notice, with the Solomon Vow out, or actually in your inventory, you can see your enemy's health. It's not bad. You can figure out who's near death and start shooting at them. 
Not bad. It does a the same damage as the Bone Salt, with it being 65 for base and 195 for crit. No biggie, right? No biggie. Doc, I need to switch loadouts. Tag out, buddy. <laughs> I find it funny that you think you can build Uber Charge faster than me. <laughs> you have no idea. Ah, the blue. Well, I've got basically, what would you call this? The Bleep Sauger loadout? Eh, more or less. I mean, it doesn't really have a name behind it either. That's what's kind of stupid. Just call it the, but... meet, the me just call it the meet the Medic loadout. Well, yeah, I guess... actually, the Meet the Medic loadout was the uh, Quick Fix set. Yeah, that was the Quick Fix set. Huh. The Bleep Sauger, interesting little thing. It takes away a little bit of the health uh, regen that the Medic's passive gives him. Yeah, he's got a passive. But, on hit, he gains plus three to his health bar. Or his, not ha not his max, like, I can't sit there and just constantly hammer somebody and have like a 10,000 point health bar. But it'll heal me as I hit somebody for three points. No matter how much damage I do, will always, always be threes. Which, interestingly enough, same clip size, same firing speed, same freaking arc. Same damage? Same damage. Except, you know, it's always nice to, you know, you're, you're hitting somebody with darts, and all you see above your health bar is just this wall of threes. <laughs> Which, I don't think I've, I... It's... It... Really, I've never had it crit. I mean, I have, but not pop. <laughs> okay. Why don't you just prove me a little bit more wrong, huh? Dude, that doc's been having a bad day with TF2 guys. This is oh. our, this is our what fourth? Oh. Fifth. Hell. What take is this? What number is it? Um, I think this is four. Four. Uh, five. That's that's how much bad luck we've been having. What first, first, our mic started cutting in and out. Then the server was deciding to be a douche. We couldn't use our items. Then we couldn't get connected to one another. And then we finally, as we're about to start recording, turns out my laptop decided to do a force update. Oh, no. That's just, we've only done it four times today. Oh. That's not counting the three times we tried to do it yesterday. Or the three times the day before that. Before that, yeah. I know, right? And it's not as bad as the very first time we tried this. It literally ended with tears. We were that annoyed. Oh my god. I almost didn't even want to keep going. No. We were literally yeah. on like... Like, fuck this. Uh, we were on like take 10. We, we were, were getting so frustrated with everything. Oh my god. You know what's so funny is I could explain my Crits Creek and my uh, Ubersaw at the same damn time. Oh my god. Do tell. Hold on. What? Let's see your Uber char Let's see your Uber saw. Ooh, so bland. No. And it's kill. No, you know. Is that a blowtorch on the end of it? No, that's a needle. Oh. You. Oh no. Twenty-five percent Uber charge. Where did that come from? Fifty. Hundred. Give me all your medics! Doc, let us see your Ubersaw now, my friend. It has color in it. That is my Uber Charge bar. Dead giveaway for when a medic really has a full Uber Charge, though. I tell you what. It, doesn't it have like a 25% slower hit speed? Yeah, or 20. It hits 20% slower, but gives you 25% Uber Charge. That thing crits like a bitch. Now, the reason I explained the Ubersaw first is because, well, let's face it, <laughs> I didn't have a freaking Uber meter at all. Hmm. I had zero. Well, now I'm going to explain the Kritzkrieg. <laughs> Dev loves this fucking media because of this right here. Dev, have at them. You've got a 100% chance to crit. And let me tell you, it is ridiculous. It's not bad that I crit enough. How about we give it a 100% chance? Alright. Oh my god! What, what, I can't remember the server we were playing on, but you had a beggar's bazooka and you fired into a room of people right as I critted you. 
Yeah, I remember that day. We were in this <laughs> unique server. He crit creeps me as I launched in there. I think it was like a 10x server. I think so. You just ripped into people. It was disgusting. To put it simple, you guys remember the beggar's bazooka from the soldier video. Now, I, I do want to point something interesting, though, about the uh, Crit Creek Uber Saw combo. Okay. My Uber charge is going. As I, un as I release, it starts to burn. Excuse me. Just got it completely back, and I'm continuing the Uber charge. Oh, you so, talked about the. You talked about some hard things to do. Though, I can keep my Uber charge going forever. Still going. Still going. And it just. It's like the freaking Energizer Bunny. It just doesn't stop. Oh god, I missed. <laughs> Give me all your Ubers. See? Let's Watch, guys. Actually, Boom. It, back at full. Do it one more time. Report. I'll let it end up a little bit. You guys saw those numbers, didn't you? Bam. Doc, it's my turn. Charge me. Aw. Uh, I can't do that, sir. That would be breaking the game. Wow. The Uber kind of ran out. Fixing. Uber saw is a magnificent weapon. I love it. Oh my god, is it ever. Plus, I swear it does the most damage of all the melee weapons. Ah, show, let's show them the crits with this thing as soon as we get to explaining this weapon. Oh my god, yes. Is it my turn, Doc? I don't know. Are, are puppies purple? Yes. Then yes. Okay. This loadout is the simple loadout called the Medieval Medic loadout. Ignore the quick fix, just ignore it. In a map called the Group Keep, you lose all normal like weapons, the minigun, the meta gun, the sniper rifles, the flamethrowers, you lose everything. However, the Crusader's crossbow and the amputator will always be there. It's a unique set for that map only. Oh, and you all keep your melee weapons. That's how you fight is melee only. Wow. Yeah, I love the map. It's the group keep. I love it. Demo man. Uh, God, that map is notorious for its demo nights. <laughs> but the cool thing about this Crusader's crossbow is it brings back the old medic from Team Fortress Classic back, where the me old medic could hit comrades and enemies alike. When he hits his enemies, he hurts them, like so. 74. Yep. 75. It Whereas doesn't if have I to do damage the farther away your opponent is, or heal for more, vice in versa. Indeed, my friend. When I hit my comrades, though, the dart stops and slams right into Doc's face. <laughs> ah! It's in my nose! <laughs> Get it out! Fixing. Ah, I'm good! No, explain the Chris Creek uh, taunt real quick. Oh. Oh yeah, I didn't explain that, did I? When I do this, my taunt actually gives me health back. Not much, but generally enough to survive being burned alive. Uh, you're covered in darts. I noticed that. I have kind of got darts in my ankles, darts in my knees. Pretty sure there's a dart in my ass, but I can't tell. Because there's darts in my eyes. Literally, there's one sticking out of my eyelid. You, sir, are a douche. I love you, too. But anyway, going back to the Crusader's crossbow... It brings back the old medic's healing factor when he shoots comrades. It's amazing. The further the enemy and the further the comrade, the more you heal and the more you deal. Damn. The, cool, the cool part is it's got a nice arc that you can easily work with. Oh, come on. That touched. Doc will agree with me when I say this. This is our favorite medic, medic melee weapon. Which one? Because you crossbow. You said melee weapon. No, I meant shooting weapon. Oh. Me Dead. Ooh, ooh! And Quick, now. Dad. See that NG all the way in the back? Go get him! Oh god! Oh my god! See, this weapon is disgusting in crit strike. There's just like nothing out there. The on There's only <laughs> one thing that can survive it, and that's the heavy. And even then, he's too busy taking the second dart to the face. Oh god, I didn't even crit that one. 
Now, let's talk about the Amputator. The Amputator doesn't do much. It's basically like the other Medi guns and all Medi weapon, melee weapons. They took out the buff that the Crusader's crossbow and the Amputator took, so the Amputator is not really seen as much anymore. But it's still there. Doesn't it have an annoying taunt? Yes, it does. But it, it still has its taunt. However, the passive that the Ambassador here and the Crusader's crossbow both had... Wait, Ambassador? It Oh my god, you're not playing a spy, Dev. The Amputator. Derp. Derp. Oh, did you know the taunt kill for um the the uh, medic does 501 damage? <laughs> it has to make sure it's get that last little one there. No, no, seriously, it does one point of damage at the beginning. Mm -hmm. Then it does the 500. It's gotta I make sure. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm sorry, how much was I doing? One? Five hundred. But, uh, as I was saying, the Amputator and the Crusader's Crossbow's old passive is instead of healing three health as a normal medic, it boosts it up to, I do believe, five. So. Aww. Oh. But, oh well, it might have lost its passive, but it's got its old taunt still. You see this aura I'm giving off? I'm healing everyone within my taunt area radius. All comrades would get healed by it. It is a great de group keep weapon to keep comrades alive at times of need. Doc, shall we explain the next loadouts? Wow. Isn't that isn't the next one supposed to be Oh well, that's right, the next one's my man versus machine loadout. Yeah. No, remember your that was last. No, my favorite loadout was last. Oh yeah, that's right. You want to explain uh, Gersler first? Sure. What the fuck? Ah, here we go. Ah, yes. Well, when I'm playing Man vs. Machine, as Dev just, you know, explained, the Crusader's Crossbow. Obviously, Dev just explained it, so I'm not going to go into, like, major uh, detail. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, Doc. I forgot to explain one thing. The Crusader's Crossbow has one bullet in it, and how many extra? Uh, one bullet and 38 max ammo. So. Unless you're playing Man vs. Machine, and then it has a 9-round clip when fully upgraded with, like, a 60 or, or 90 or something for a max ammo, and it fires like a freaking machine gun. Meaning you can insta-heal anybody from anywhere, ever. <laughs> sorry, we're, sorry, 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 guys, sorry, guys. Now, one a thing Dev hasn't explained is my medigun. Which yeah. I'm jelly of him. I know, because I found it while we were recording, weren't we? Yes. Okay. That was one of the my test runs. Gun. Why am I trying to build it like that? Give me your Uber charge. I need it more than you do. Thank you. My, my, er, my medigun is called the Vaccinator. Which, the reason I prefer it for Man vs. Machine is... That little marker above Dev's head, he is now, what is it, 25% bulletproof? Yeah, you've got it too, don't forget. Yep, I also get the buff. It's, oh, it's a constant 10%. It's, it's 75, it goes up to 75% when I, when I pop the Uber. So right now, we're bulletproof, basically. But it has such a short Uber charge, I can also make you immune to explosives and fire. Don't forget about the, uh, little yep. overheal. Yeah, the minus 66% overheal build rate. Yeah, it, it's it's a downfall. You can't, you can't overheal people as effectively, but my god, you can make them bulletproof. And it comes with four charges of uber charge. So, there was one, two, three... Four. And it also gains a 50% overcharged build rate, which is really nice for when you're just, you know, constantly in a fight. It, and what I like is how the four segments are split up. You don't have to wait until all the seg segments are full to use it. You can literally use it as soon as the first segment is charged. Fire, Doc, I'm on fire! Oh, you're on fire? Crap, push the wrong button. You're dead. Fire! Voila. 
That was bullet resistance, but you know, whatever. No, that was we were just showing the example. I cannot build Uber charge though while it is going, as far as I know. No. Yeah, no, it doesn't look like that. I wonder. I haven't taunt I don't think I've ever taunt killed somebody while having this. I need to burn here, let me burn my couple things real quick. I'm not sure how the Uber saw reacts with these gauges. Let's find out. Okay, it does. It, it, it will insta-fill all four gauges on your Uber charge. Nice, my friend. And obviously the Uber saw, which I explained, and for obvious reasons, is one of my preferred uh, man versus machine melee weapons. Just for the fact that, you know, when in, when in danger, you know, pull out your Uber saw and run like hell and just stab people to death. Oh no, Dev. What? Ow. Somehow get that demo man behind you. I'm trying to stick it in your ear. Is it in your ear yet? I don't know. There is a dart sticking out of your hat. Wall of threes! I had to do it once. I can also not change what is what the protection is in the middle of an Uber charge, which is kind of crappy, but oh well. Fucking vital assault OP. I don't like it though. It doesn't have much of an effect. You lose 10 health when you have it. However, right. here's the best way to explain it, Doc. What's my Uber charge right now? 100%. Nine. I kept nineteen percent of my Uber charge. It says twenty on my screen. Hmm. Mine. Mine says nineteen. Nine. The Vita saw lets you keep ten percent or ten or twenty percent of your Uber charge when you die. I don't remember what is it. Twenty percent of your stored Uber charge that you had. Before you died, you get to keep. So if you're at 100, you get to keep 20% of it. Eh, it's okay if you like it and all. I don't like it. I prefer the Uber Salt. Doc, let's just explain our last loadout, seeing as how we were running out. I know, right? Well, my last loadout is, as I said before, my preferred, like, actually against other people loadout. It, it combines the Overdose, the Medigun, and the Uber Saw. Um, honestly, they've all been explained. The overdose, obviously, I keep that around not for the damage, but, uh, like, as I build Uber Charge, it builds up movement speed. So if I need to get away, there it is. As well as I can constantly pop between my, uh, my Uber, my Uber Charge Medigun and my overdose, and I believe... If you do it quick enough, you actually are immortal for a while while still getting a bit of that movement speed boost. But you have to be very quick about it. It doesn't really work at times, and sometimes yeah. it causes a lot of lag, so it's not really recommended, honestly. Yeah, because you pretty much have to sit there and mash 1 and 2 and run. Or Q. And look, or Q, and you look retarded doing it. Milo, you done, Doc, or you still good? Oh, uh, yeah. And... I mean, honestly, all I have is the overdose, the truly feared medigun, and the Uber saw. Why don't you go ahead and uh, go to the next surprise for them? Why wow. the fuck is there a dart in my eye? <laughs> I love you. I hate you so much. <laughs> this is how much I hate you. I hate you so much, I'm pretty sure I killed that pyro. <laughs> After I impaled the demo man. So we're moving on? Moving on. Alright, yeah. my favorite loadout for the medic is the Crusader's Crossbow, the Quick Fix, and the Uber Saw. I, I, I'm the healing medic. Although, in, TF, in League of Legends, I fucking suck as a support. Well, okay, okay, I need to rephrase this. I'm actually good as a support. Doc, fill them in on who I'm good with, real quick. Zona. Yes. Plain and simple. But that's basically how this loadout works and everything, and I switch back over to Dr. McKernia. How the fucking... Needs uh -oh. more bacon. Hail to the no. 
Who's needs more bacon? I don't know, but guess who's getting kicked? Somebody kiss my server! Okay. I can't kick him. Why? We are, uh, experiencing pins. Name, name, needs not, needs more bacon. Is there something special about him? Fuck it. We have some technical difficulties. We will see you all in the next part of this series. Thank you, everyone, and we will see you all in the next part. Whee!